How's it going guys? Thanks a lot for joining me for a beer review once again. Uh, today I'm at Buddy's Wedding. Um, yeah, having a couple beers. Uh, just had the reception and waiting for the uh, bar to um, open up. And uh, in the meantime, have a couple drinks, you know. Might as well do a beer review. Uh, today's beer that I'm reviewing is going to be from E9 Brewery out in Tacoma, Washington. Uh, it's their Le Visiteur, a collaboration with a uh, beer Trois Dames out in, uh, I think, uh, Belgium or France, one of the two. But uh, yeah, there we go. It's an American wild ale with blackberry and nectarberry coming in at 5.7% alcohol by volume. Saw it in the store, never heard of this brewery even, um, so decided to pick it up. Looked it up. Uh, on like untapped and stuff and people were absolutely loving it so um figured yeah gotta do a review of it you know see what i think so first time ever trying e9's beers and i'm pretty stoked uh wow that is a really really red color sadly lots of water spots on this glassware oh, make sure this doesn't fall as i tap it but yeah, there we go. Nice looking beer, super red, as you would expect from a, what is it again, blackberry and nectarberry beer. Um, yeah, nice pink head. Wow, this is a lopsided table. But um, yeah, uh, looks really nice. A little bit of a pink head, um, tons of carbonation, and tons of water spots there. But um, yeah, let's get an aroma. Ooh, wicked, wicked sour. That smells good. Yeah, super lemony, super tart, almost like vinegary kind of sourness. It's making my mouth absolutely water. Big berry aromas. <sighs> nice sweetness to it, like this blackberry jam kind of quality in the background there. Hints of honey, some uh, some nice funky barnyard kind of notes. It smells absolutely awesome so let's try it out cheers yeah that's really good um big tart yet slightly sweet berry notes um sharp sourness nice amount of carbonation really puckering i'm liking that that's a really flavorful beer for 5.7 percent alcohol you're getting a big 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 uh sour beer profile off this one mouth feels great it's nice and light and spritzy but it's still got a nice like not a chew but a nice like i don't know breadiness to the mouthfeel too um really liking it carbonation is almost like champagne like just across the palate there really cool finish finishes not too dry at all uh there is a little bit of like a almost oaky kind of thing something like that <coughs> i forgot to mention i think this might be aged in some sort of barrel if i were to guess it, i didn't really research it much but uh, if I were to guess some sort of white wine barrel or some sort of red wine, because it does have a vinous kind of quality to it. Um, but yeah, all in all, really, really damn good. This is one of the better sours I have had all year. I mean, this is awesome. Um, gonna have to check out more of these guys' beers because this is great stuff. If you love sour beers as I do, um, this is a great one. Super sour, super... Um, yeah, just acidic, almost vinegary. Um, if you love sour candies and stuff like that, this is a beer for you. Sweet, sweet stuff. So, yeah, pick up E9 Breweries Le Visiteur um, in collaboration with Dear de Trois Dames. Um, pretty cool stuff. As for a rating, I go like right around like honestly like a 95. It's really friggin' good. Uh, this is a treat. I'm gonna share it with my boys here. And um, yeah, have a great night. Pretty sure most of them like sour beers, so this should be a nice treat for them all. 
So there we go. Thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know what y'all think of this beer, any other beers by E9 Brewery out there in Tacoma, Washington. Thanks a lot for watching. Till the next time, cheers.